Peace and power, man. Peace and power to my sisters. Peace and power to my bros. Peace and power to the ones that, you know what I'm saying, don't know what's going on, but they just like, man, what's this drop thing about? Man, peace to you, man. You know what I mean? Just for taking the time. That's the door, man. That's the door that we're all walking through together. We're walking through the same door. So never feel like you alone. Never feel like you're secluded. Man, we just chilling. We regular folk just like you, man. We just looking around and things are starting to connect. And we're starting to realize we're we're really not so regular after all. We're really, you know what I'm saying, a part of a wave, a part of a connection. That's Drop Nation. We Drop Nation across the plane. All right? There ain't no, you know, sign up, man. You wake up and look in the mirror. You, you know, you got that drop, man. You got it in you. That's all we're saying. Forget about the English and, and titles. We're just saying that within you is the connectivity. And that's what we're calling that purified substance, man. That's what it's all about. That's that drop, man. That's that drop, man. Oh, yeah, man. I put this through a couple of uh, rinse cycles, man. So I feel a little better. But they do get a little shrinkage. So, you know what I'm saying? You want, might want to order a size, you know, a little step up. This, I think, was a, a, um, a medium. Maybe it was a large, but it feels more like a medium. I don't know, man. But, you know what I'm saying? So if you get these no hijack shirts, man, you get these Drop Nation shirts, you know, just know a couple of rinse cycles may turn a medium into a schmedium. But we still know hijacks allowed, man. We still know hijacks, man. Hey, look, man. Hey, a couple of rinse cycles, man. The letters are staying on all right, man. You know, these are these are our own experiences, man. So I like it, man. I'm about to start getting these out, you know, on a regular now. So if you like these no hijacks, man, you want to rock that no hijack, let them know, man. Let them know. No hijacks allowed, man. Love to the fan band, man. We just putting together whatever vibration awareness, man, so we can be out in the streets and be like, man, you know what I'm saying? What's what you mean no hijacks, man? No bad energy, man. No negative vibes, man. Don't kill my vibe, man. No hijacks allowed, man. You trying to get it between me and my hawa, my source. No hijacks allowed, man, all day. We keep it pushing, man. We say get with it or get left on around here, man. Man. Love to the family, man. Love to all my, all my real ones out here in Inglewood, L.A., South Central, man. These are all my home turfs, man. I grew up all around L.A., man. So love to all the street fam, man. That's just, you know, tuning in, man, seeing, seeing what's happening in real time. I love y'all, man. If, if it ain't about y'all, it ain't about nothing. If it ain't about the little homie in the back of the class, man, that, that is me, that is you, it ain't about nothing, man, because that's the power, man, when, when, when tribes become tribes, you know what I'm saying? They always say we in gangs and all our gang stuff, but that's just tribal. Even I just watched a Tupac interview. He said the same thing. He's like, man, gangs are tribes, you know what I'm saying? It's just that, obviously, you fell out of conscience. You forgot what you was fighting for. You forgot you was on your own land. The invasion happened to you, and now you form gangs against each other? What part of the game is that? Who does that benefit? Who comes up? when you form gangs against each other. Now we know we had tribal war, but if you're not even in the consciousness of the tribal war, then you're just talking about colors and colors and blocks and money, monies and paper. <laughs> you fight over paper, man. I know psychologically that makes sense to you right now, but one day you're gonna wake up and you're gonna hold that so-called dollar spell and you're gonna look at it and you're like, this is what I was dying for, paper. Because they may say it's worth something, but that's just what they say. That's just the system they put on it to make it appear in their illusion that that piece of paper that you could wipe your butt with, boom, throw it in a, you know, throw it in a swirler. You know, you really think it's worth something, man. You really think it's worth dying for, man, because they, they gave it value. So if... Whoever gives it value is the one that's going to be your master. Whoever is giving the paper its value. A system of giving paper value is not what you value. It's not reality. A system of paper value and plastic. So you think you's a baller, huh? Because you got lots of papers and plastics. Man, you better get off that bullshit. Better stop spinning on that ball. Better wake up and be a tribe. And wake up and, and honor your ancestors that fought and died in these wars, man. You know what I'm saying? It's not about 
know what I'm saying, going buck wild crazy. You don't got to go crazy when you know who you are. When you know who you are, you just, you know, awaken and you look around and you say, okay, all right. Well, the first thing we need to do is educate ourselves and, and not their education. We need to surf the wave. And all praise, hawa hawa. We have a wave that is now available for us to surf. We're doing our part, you know what I'm saying, individually to be one, to come back to one, to realize our oneness. That individual is a collective. And now we got a wave. Now we got a nation that got the drop. And I just can't be, you know what I'm saying, more proud for my sisters and my bros and vibing in real time, man. I mean, when I could wake up, man, and check these comments, man, here, the emails, man, it just, you know what I mean, it's, you know, <laughs> to get the life-changing, you know, elements that's happening in, in, in the family's life because they picked up a certain book, not just a book that was, you know, given to them as a curriculum in, in college or whatever the case is, <clears throat> but they picked up a certain book, man, you know. All these university degrees don't mean nothing if you don't know what you're looking for. I went to UC Davis. You know what I'm saying? I was doing mechanical engineering for like the first three and a half years, man. Love to all my family, love, love to the, love, love to Mordecai, love to the tribe, man. You know what I'm saying? I mean, you know, the tribe is, all, is always connected. We might not know we're a tribe, but we're a tribe. And we're, we're, you're tribing up wherever you go and you don't comprehend, you know what I'm saying, what it is until you wake up one day and say, wow, you know what I'm saying? It's now time to walk through this door together. It's now time to know where we're going instead of being the blind leading the blind man so yeah in college I took all these engineering classes and I switched to uh, business I came out you know what I'm saying doing uh, uh, like stockbroker stuff man I was doing in uh, intern at Merrill Lynch and Morgan Stanley and all these big companies and I came out working in the stock market and all that man and even then man at 21 22 year old Marcus it was breaking my heart, man, to see how this op how the operation was really flowing, how how this stuff really goes, man. And you know, needless to say, man, one day <laughs> I went, you know, I checked in, you know, my my 7 a.m. meeting. I got my three piece suit on. I'm walking through this, you know, what I'm saying, you know, big Fortune 500 company. I, I got my little uh, cubicle, you know, what I'm saying, and I'm sitting there, and I'm in this, you know, in the morning meeting, and to this day. I can't comprehend what made me, you know, <laughs> literally, you know, put foot to action. But I literally, I, I got up in the meeting, walked out the meeting, went to my cubicle, grabbed my Chinese bamboo plant that my wife just gave me, <laughs> took my plant and walked out the door and never looked back. And I was at, you know, I was, I'm 37 now. So this happened over 15 years ago and from that point. You know, just been <laughs> navigating, you know what I'm saying, through what seemed like a, a dark, a dark, uh, you know, cavern, you know what I'm saying? It seems like we're all in these tunnels. We don't, you know, you're just doing what feels good. You're trying to do what feels good. Sometimes it feels good not to make a move like that. All I know is that that wasn't the drop. That somehow, you know what I'm saying, <laughs> through another path that wasn't carved out, I had to carve it out. I had to. You know what I'm saying? Trust the most high and, and literally carve this thing out. And now it's led me to you right here. And that was 15 years ago. You know, I can keep going on with my life, you know what I'm saying? But just to let you know, man, that this is miraculous, man. You know what I'm saying? To be here today, it's not something I take for granted. We've all had to sacrifice. We've all take, taken L's. We've all made mistakes. But, you know, the fact that you kept getting up has led you to this point right here where you're sitting here, you're watching this video, I'm over here. You know what I'm saying? Just kicking it with you on the Shabbat with a purpose in mind, man, to connect to a tribe. A tribe that no one probably thought existed two years ago or a, a tribe that you might have thought you had to, you know what I'm saying, go to the government to get recognized for it, for, <laughs> for them that invaded you to consider you a tribe on your own. That doesn't sound like sovereignty. That doesn't sound like a natural born right. It doesn't sound like you've been, you know, blessed with a birthright. You know what I mean? So I'm just saying, man, all praise to Wah for, for the path I've taken, for the path you've taken, for the path we've taken. And we all know now that we've been surfing the wave the whole time. Whatever got me out that seat, got me out that three-piece, 
<laughs> so I could stop, uh, you know, just just taking people's money is all they do. You know, they, they form a system and they steal through the system that they form. And they keep stealing through the system that they form and they call that interest on this and this, this, this. And they have all these fancy names for these different funds and these funds are this, ICS funds are this, and professionally managed money this way. And all they're talking about is paper money and you're walking around in this system and you forgot that you have gold here. You forgot that the gold is yours. You now are in the illusion that they're sharing your gold because they stole your gold. Because they stole your gold, they're now sharing your gold. No, they're not even sharing your gold, right? You're not under the illusion that they're sharing no gold with you. You got no gold. You're under the illusion, under the spell that you have nothing. And that's the worst we've ever been. Man, love to the family, AD, man. We just had a wonderful, you know what I mean, kickback, man. And, uh, you know what I'm saying? We're saying, uh, I was saying, you know, was Atlantis worse than this? Atlantis had to be, you know, so, so far worse for it to be blown to bits and all that. And the bro had a great point. He said, man, at least they knew who they were, you know. We're at a point now where we don't even know anything. We've never been at such a sad state of disregard for ourselves, um, such, such such a sad state of, of just ignorance, meaning the lack of the knack, the lack of knowledge. To be at a point where you just don't know anything about yourself has to be the worst point we've ever been at, ever, ever, you know. So yes, this must be far worse than Atlantis, and if that's what happened to Atlantis, you know, dig on it, because it's about to go down, you know what I'm saying? This can't continue. You can't keep being asleep looking for paper money and plastic and saying that that's your security, because there's an electronic system that has numbers on it, and you think that that represents you. You think that's real, because you can log in somewhere and see numbers under your name under your corporate name. You look and look at your corporate identity and then you see numbers and you say, cool, I'm rich. You used to walk on your land and say that. <laughs> you never had to log into a fictitious system to know or to feel security. You never had to open up a wallet and pull out paper, worthless fucking paper and say, look at me and then put it by your ear and, and do the money phone. Jigger would never have to say, nigga, grow up. But he's over here doing it with the plastic. And you're looking around and you're like, none of y'all got your actual birthright. None of y'all are actually just rich by birth. You're supposed to be rich by birth because you're a nation of priest kings and queens of the connection of that Sheba, that Solima, right here. We're talking Kalelus, Howie Koo. We're talking Granata. Again, love to the family AD, man. We dig on that Granata. Granata means pomegranate. And you can look at a map in the 1500s in the book Forbidden Histories of the Americas by, by David Lowe, where he's showing you Granata covering the four corners. Utah, New Mexico, Colorado, Arizona, all named Granata, which means pomegranate. Remember, Moses sent the scouts. He sent Joshua and Caleb to get, to spy, to, to get the promised land uh, pomegranate. He went to the pomegranate to get the, the promised land. He got the pomegranate as proof of being in the promised land. So what is this pomegranate all about? What does the pomegranate rep represent, and how is it tied into the promised land, and why is the entire Four Corners named pomegranate? This is consciousness. That's a wave we're surfing. This is the old world and you're from here, Negro. That's the wave we're surfing. That's why we're no hijacks allowed. No hijacks allowed, man. That's the wave we're surfing. You're in the old world and you're from it. Now you dig on it. Now you run from that. You. 
you go scurry away from that, from reality, back to what the teacher taught you. Because the teacher taught you that this is new world. It's new world order. It's not new world. How is it new world when it's sandwiched between Lemuria and Atlantis? How is it possible that this is a new world and that's an old world when this world is sandwiched between Atlantis and Lemuria? And we know it all connects. We know it's all connected. It's all one body with energy points and energy portals. So if the people of Mu felt a vibration that was the same as it connected to Mount Shasta in California was all connected to Mu and the vibration coming out of Mount Shasta was completely, you know what I'm saying, um, you know, synchronized with the people of Mu. That's why they connected to Shasta. I mean, this is in the stuff that we're digging on and that's the way we're surfing and this is the vibration. Now, now you're talking about an awareness of vibration. You're saying that as an energy center or as a chakra, the area of Mount Shasta or the tree Shasta, because mountains are trees, right? That's the wave we're surfing. You see what I'm saying? That's the info that you're not getting. That's the info that we're digging on. That's the info that we're asking questions of being scientific and using repeatable and observable science. Mountains are trees. Mount Shasta is tree Shasta. The roots of the trees, if the trees extend to the firmament, how far do the roots go? Are they the foundations? Are the roots the crystal foundations? And you just talk in frequency. And Mount Shasta has a vibration that is synchronized with the people of Mu. In Kali. Kali means black. But we're not talking black. We're talking rich, ruddy, copper color. We're talking the red man. The copper color man is the red man. And we're talking Mu, Mount Shasta, vibration. So when I say what vibration are you in, and you're not vibrationally connected to a land. If you have no vibration ties to your land, Negro, then you're asleep. Don't call yourself conscious. If you're only connected to Africa, when you're in a land that's the old world, sandwiched between Atlantis and Lemuria, but you must go to Africa. Do what daddy taught you, right? Do what the teacher taught you, right? Do what master taught you, right? You're who he taught you, right? Master said you're from Africa, you from Africa. But they've just found you here, 1828 Webster Dictionary. And you're in a land that's sandwiched between Atlantis and Lemuria. You're in the old world. So when you surf the wave, and we come together, and we know what we're standing on, and we know we're in an ancient world, the ancient world, as the ancient people. And you know you're from here. You know it's your birth right here. And from that point on, it's Shabbat Shalom, man. It's Shalom. It's devouring chaos, man. Everything else that's being brought to you is chaotic after that, man. You devour the chaos that says that this world is new when it's not. You devour the chaos that says that, oh, here's a new test. And connect it to the Greek. But we just found you here in the old world, Negro. But you must read English to know the story. But we just found you here in the old world, Negro. And this is being restored right beneath your feet. The crystals beneath your feet. If you're not feeling it, and you're not vibing up, and you're not tribing up, suiting up, choosing up. You know what I'm saying? If you ain't choosing up, making the right choice, man. You're not surfing the wave, man. Gotta be Calabunga, dude, or it's nothing at all. It's gotta be Calabunga on the way, man. You gotta belly flop, become the water. Pretty soon, you're not gonna need the surfboard. Pretty soon, it's just gonna be the flow that takes over you. You're not gonna resist it anymore. You're gonna be one. Be one. <laughs> you and you be one. We are one. We connect, man. So, peace and power to the tribe connecting with you on a wonderful Shabbat. You know, telling you thank you for surfing the wave. <laughs> Lastly, man, y'all go dig on it, man. Dig on the site. The Vibe Suites are coming up real soon, probably today. And uh, the radio and all that's being connected through that. So I got all that connected, man. And 
We look forward to greatness, man. Love to Isaac Ford for tuning us above the barrier, man. Go check out the playlist. You know what I'm saying? We're going to put all those on the site, all the drop albums. It will be password protected. So make sure you subscribe to the site, 432thedrop.com. Subscribe to it. Um, you know, definitely, you know, check out the drop two in the package. Check out, check out the drop shop. Support Paco's King Oil. Man, get the drop tees in there. Love the Sister V, Sister Vanessa. Got that shea butter, man. We about to put in the drop shop, man. And if you got a dope product that's good and beneficial and healthy for the community, we love to support you. Just uh, all we need is a few pictures so we can do your slideshow. And then we'll uh, put a link up to connect it to whatever your uh, payment, you know, whatever your, if it's a uh, eBay, Amazon, or if you're just doing it direct, you know, we'll put all the information on there for you. And just link it to you, man, and that goes directly to you, you know. We just want you to come up. We just want you to feel, you know what I'm saying, like you can stabilize yourself as entrepreneurs, man. You know what I mean? That you can work for yourself and you can build up. You know what I mean? And get out of these traps, man. Get out of these systems that are, are telling you, you know, what your schedule is. You know what I'm saying? So now you can start to build and free your mind and have the freedom, really, to keep that Shabbat, to keep your balance, man, to keep vibrating up. So support the drop shop. Uh, love to Jay Stu, man. Y'all go support Jay Stu's baby fun. Love to the sister Camelia having their first child. You know what I'm saying? We've seen it the whole way. We've seen it. You know, flow, they've been, you know, truly water the whole time, man. So we know this baby's coming out just, <laughs> you know, straight up, straight up, uh, you know, belly flopping, man. You know what I mean? So peace to the family. Go support the Jace 2 uh, Baby Fun. Click below and just start uh, showering the family with your love and support because this is your tribe in real time. You know what I'm saying? This is your opportunity to support something that you've seen grow, you know what I'm saying, from the infant, infant, infant stage, man, where we just kicking out talking about Columbus and the Biblioteca de Columbina and then divide that man into a tribe that has acquired 10 acres of land to build as a refuge and we love you and appreciate your patience as we start to put the beginning touches and, and, and preparations and safety measures man and all that stuff so you know it's, it's, it's just an example you know what I'm saying and by watching that we know that so much of the family is literally doing the same thing man around them tribing up vibing up getting land around them, doing their thing, man. And uh, this is something that we know is going to have a much higher connection, you know, as we start to vibrate again with our trees. It's just about getting there, man. Not one particular place or one particular, but just getting there, getting out of her. Step, step one, get out of her. Then let the most high, you know, vibe you up and tribe you up and put you in that frequency with your mountains, with your trees around you. That's your home, all right? You hold it down. Hold down where you at. We'll, you know, definitely merge, man, and, and grow as the creator continues to vibe us up. Don't get freaked out by all the weird stuff everybody else is focusing on. You keep vibing up. You have a different path, a different reality. The better you are, the worse it is for them. The better the system is, the worse it is for you. Their peace is not your peace. Their peace is war on you, obviously, right? Right? You're prisoners of war, right? You were found here put in captivity not slave captivity they want you to think you're slaves no you were captives of war they came on your land and invaded your ass you fought they killed your priest they killed you know what I'm saying everybody man you know what I'm saying and you got scattered you got put in boats from Florida to Mississippi or to the to the uh, Dominican Republic what they, you know whatever they call that you know what I'm saying then shipped to Africa then shipped to Guyana, then, then shipped to Europe, then to Spain and Portugal. You were shipped all over. But this is the Milton Pot, man. South America, Central America, the Yucatan, Mexico, Mexican. Keep digging on it, man. We'll be right back with that. Get back into that syntax grammar. You know, we got a good little lineup, man. I, I normally don't expose my lineup. But we're going to get into some good stuff, man. We're going to get into the Khan Dynasty a little bit. The Khan Dynasty, man. We got to... Tie that into the serpent dynasty, the Khan dynasty, what we're calling the, the serpents that are devouring the venomous snakes, where we're talking about energy, nothing spooky, we're just talking energy, frequency, and vibration, and whatever freaks them out shouldn't freak you out. That lets you know you're out of their mind. Whatever they taught you to fear, you know what I'm saying, they just taught you because they fear. They're putting their fear on you and then trapping you with their fear. 
So we're going to get into some of that, get back to the syntax grammar, get back into paleo, get back into forbidden histories, get in that Tusco aura. Then we'll get into that Preston John. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you a secret right now. When we get back into Preston John, we're going to stay in Preston John. When we get back in Preston John, we get to Preston John. If you ain't seen Preston John 1 through 27, you got some, you know what I'm saying, belly flopping to do. But yeah, get on it, man. We'll be right back with Preston John 28. Love to the fan that's surfing the wave. Love to the tribe. Love to the home team. Everybody going through real things, the real ones, man. Love to the fam. Hire Mark. Hire Mark don't get enough, you know what I'm saying? You know, shout outs, man. You know what I'm saying? Uh, uh, we we got to spread the frequency on the family that's really putting it all in to, you know, continue to spread this vibe, man. You know, with, with <laughs> complete, you know what I'm saying? Just fearlessness you know what i'm saying brother like higher mar belly flop man a while back man and just jumped in and just did nothing but the most highest work nothing but hawa coming out the brother you know what i'm saying just just giving you all the exposure man from the grand canyon man uh decapitating all hijacks man decapitating the zeus decapitating all that exposing the anasazi bringing you back home letting you know you know what i'm saying that hey all this land here is all in the federal trust 700 million acres plus the brother's breaking down the trust he's breaking down the laws to you so man go subscribe and get in the classroom of high mark the same goes for the family getting to the root for jay stew wonderful classroom you got to keep digging on the classrooms of the fan bam medicine man getting the family john john man yohanathan hebrew prince love to you bro uh karimu karumu you know i'm talking about love to you man Teach, teach me to be preachy. Love to you, brother. Fan bam, man. We're just talking tribe. Natural by law. We're just talking tribe, man. And nothing more. We're just talking tribe, man. And we're coming right in your face bone. And the drop don't stop. You know what I mean? We will be eventually over there at 432thedrop.com only. When you click, when you go to 432thedrop.com and you click that play button to the far right, pretty soon that's all we're going to be kicking is right out that play button. So, I'll praise the most high for kind of putting us through this detour through YouTube, but I don't live in YouTube. This is not, you know, I, I don't live here. This is not our home. We have a home. We have a place. We got things to do. We have a movement and we have a wave. We don't have to function through Google. We don't have to function through whatever the case is, but if we're going to use this internet thing, we can at least be in our own cozy situation. Y'all go vibe in the chat room. Everybody check it out, man. The password for the site, one more time, is 1234. And that will be changing soon. When you subscribe, then I have everybody's email. I can just put you, you know, a big mass email. Boom! Here's a new password. So you'll have the new password every time we switch it up to keep the hijacks out. Because as you already know, man. No hijacks allowed. No hijacks allowed. No bad frequency. No negative vibration. No one trying to take us off our path, man. Just because they feel this or they feel that. You better feel up and vibe up. You better get on that surfboard and surf the wave. You better pull out your golden shovel and dig on it. Get with it or get left on. We're talking Tribe Nation. I love y'all, man. We tribing up. We vibing up. We staying up. Suiting up. Choosing up. Hawa, hawa. Everybody, when you breathe, every breath is hawa. <sighs> When you breathe in, that's the, that's like the feminine, right? The, that's the, ah, that's the breath, that's the reveal, that's the hey, that's the ha, that's the, wow, the wow, that tent peg, that's your security, that's your foundation, that's your security, so you got a secure breath, you got your, wow, wow, that's your hawa, every breath you take is, Wow. When you're working out, you're hitting the you're hitting the bench. Wow. Wow. That wow. The equally important. You can't have the wow without the the high. And the high needs the wow. You need the release. You need to inhale the exhale. So the 
wow, we're just learning how to breathe again. And this is going to help you, you know, just be conscious of your breath. And every breath you take is going to make you be conscious of Hawa. So you have your power with every breath. You have a secure breath. All praise the creator. Ah.